At Darigov Research, we specialise in open source hardware, software and education to help people tackle global issues in their local community. On the hardware side, we build and use machines that have blueprints, build instructions and diagrams which are readily open to the public. On the open source software side, we use, test, teach and improve off-the-shelf software to help tackle global issues. On the education side, we make materials such as articles, books, flashcards and do workshops on various topics including, but not limited to, machine learning, 3D printing and recycling. Open source hardware is one way that people help the wider community as it allows for improvements to surface and anyone to participate from outside of the original creators. When we can, we like to build some of them ourselves and participate in the community that forms around them. Some open source projects that we will be doing deep dives on are Precious Plastic, the low cost machines for recycling plastic, Maslow CNC, an open source upright CNC cutting machine designed to let you cut big, useful things out of wood and other flat materials. And FarmBot, a robot that handles the seeding, watering and monitoring of what you're planting. We will also explore common electronics boards that people use to get started in electronics and programming, like the Raspberry Pi and Arduino, where we will be doing a series on great bits of open source software to see how they work and if they're easy to set up on the Raspberry Pi. Some examples are Rocket Chat, an open source chat app, Octoprint, software to make 3D printing easier, and GitLab, software which is used for software development. We also hope to go over some of the tools that we will use on projects such as Blender and FreeCAD for 3D modeling, Inkscape and GNU image manipulation package for 2D design, Atom for programming, LibreOffice for admin work, Audacity for audio editing, and KiCad for PCB design. All of these are free and open source, which we will find helpful when we are working with collaborators on open source projects, when we want to fix some bugs in the code, or make improvements to give them back to the wider community. So, if you wish to join us on our journey or want to get started on any of these topics, feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel, turn on your post notifications and follow us on social media for updates on the latest content. If you want to reach out, you can also do that via those channels as well. We have already released 40 plus sets of flashcards that are on some of the topics that you can get stuck into in the meantime and can be found on our website. If you wish to monetarily support us in the work that we're doing, you can do that on a one-off or continuous basis by following the links on our website, darigovresearch.com. We look forward to you joining us on this journey and we'll see you in the next one.